Um, the other thing, but the two things I would have you remember about this as you're writing your own scripts. Well, I, I actually remember this scene because I remember it from the script. Because sometimes in Hollywood, I get so overwhelmed with reading not good stuff that I literally will just have a stack of scripts that I think are great writing that I will just pick up and just read just to get my brain remembering what good stuff is. And this is one of the scripts. This is Richard LeGravenay's. And you literally, on the first page of this script, know you're in great hands and you can't wait to keep reading. I also know, I'm sure, that Julia Roberts read one page of this script and was in. But you're also, as writers, having to write for actors. You're having to write great parts. Right? <coughs> Also notice the specificity of her character, because another thing I find a lot of young writers do is they think that a person's situation is character, and it is not. Because if you need, to, I was thinking, well, what are three words to describe her that immediately you know, in the first page of this script, you can describe this character, and I was thinking determined. You know her class, but that's her situation. Um, smart. There's a kind of smartness coming at her. You know, she's fighting. She's a fighter. And then I was thinking desperate. But desperate is her situation. It's not her character. And I'm not saying that the situation doesn't inform the character, but the situation tests the character. And a lot of the scripts I read, when we say there's not enough character, that's what we're talking about. You're relying on the fact that uh, of their job, Right? Or you're relying on the fact that they have no money, or you're relying on the fact of the situation they're in to be who they are. That's not who they are. A different person in her situation would make totally different choices and give you a totally different movie. Right? So what they're doing is nailing for you immediately, yes, her situation, but they're also immediately nailing for you who this woman is. When she's faced with the situation, this is what she does. And this is who we're going to follow. So I thought that was a really important thing to kind of get a differentiation of in your, in your brain as writers, to know the difference. Because when we read scripts, that's what we get, right? And that's when we start to say it's thin. <laughs>